Too early. Leave this to me. I don't think so. I think I have where rats to analyze, but I'm gonna try that anyway. I got your number. Also, all right, yeah, I figured. Oh, chakra leveled up. Let's go. Moving on then. Bum, bum. Oh, okay. They are telling me how to. Um, I think they're telling me how to get the key. I should think. I already have that. Alright, so let me see if I have this right. Are they not going to give me any hints as to how to find the skeleton key? They said something about the water, but that's all I remember. Yeah, they said the water. I would think that's where it is, right? I already got that. I think that was the feathered gloves. Alright, let's just go back to the door and see what they say. I would assume they would put the, uh, where you have to go make the skeleton key there like trigger an event i feel like the only hint they gave me was like in the water i don't know if i actually have to find it on my own i'm just gonna go back and check because the door is not that far oh wait is it unlocked huh oh uh, wait no it's there i see it all right i forgot i was this far Let's see what they say. Need to find that key. All right, but where is the key? Find a way to light the place and search for the key hidden in the water. All right, the water. So that's a decent hint. However. However, is there a way to, um... Oh, wait, is this... Can I go down here? I don't think I can. Oh, wait, I found something. Oh, I see. I see now. I think if I could find a way down there, then I would see. And I probably have to go on that side. I'm starting to get it. I, I'm a genius. I have to find all these, I think. Because this drains the water, I think. Got that out of the way. Now comes the hard part. I have to actually find a way. Oh, I see chests. I have to actually find a way down there now. From here, perhaps? Or maybe not. Take that, MP. Alright, so I found the way down. No, I didn't find the way down. That's what I'm looking for. Oh, ladder. Wow. <laughs> Either I'm blind or this game looks so good that you can't actually see little things. 
Oh, materia? This it? Oh, okay. Never mind. It's just a key to the sewers. I did see a chest on the other side, though, so I'm gonna check there before going. I actually thought that key was a materia. It looked like it. Found it. There's literally ladders next to the switches. What we got here? Andrew Gill? I'll take Gill. Gill is really hard to get, so any money is really good. Alright, now we're ready to go to the next door. Get him. Yes. Back to walking? Yeah. Looks like it. It does slow the game down a bit, but I don't mind the walking as much as I could. I feel like it could be a lot worse, but Wait it fits with the game well. I know this place. Sector 7 should be just on the other side of this waterway. Is it? So this is where Sector 6 ends. And where Sector 7 begins. Once we cross over, we can start looking for a way back to the surface. Might be harder than you think. Let's just try to make our way down this tunnel. See if we can't use those gates to clear a path. We can do this. We'll figure it out. Yeah, for sure. While looking for treasure, don't forget that. Okay. Am I going crazy or did I see a green exclamation point? But I don't know what side quest would be in the middle of nowhere. I thought I saw it though. Oh, I should be assessing. I should assess that new enemy. That's unfortunate. Entirely my fault. I've missed my chance. Fucked. Alright, I'm liking what I'm seeing. This is not the right way, meaning that there's a chance for treasure. I need to find like a switch. So maybe this is like the right way to solve the puzzle. Oh, I see it. Yeah. Oh, I see more enemies. I'm assessing them. I think I assessed the crab. Try to stay behind. So I'm gonna get him first. I ain't assessed this, definitely. It looks new. Oh, that sucks. Oh god, not sleep. Uh okay, I can't move. Come on, come on. Alright. Assessing this. I have to get ATB though. Alright, there's two. I'm just gonna get them. Are they the thing falling asleep? If they are, then that's a reason to kill them off. Let's do it right. Um Okay. Weakness. Lightning lightning and um Oh god, no, I hate this. I hate this. I actually hate falling asleep. Can you handle them? I am gonna get rid of you as soon as possible. So get him. Star shower. Gotta be careful. Know your limits. Came from there, right? Use that. Oh, that switch actually looks like the um Let's side quest thing. That's the thing I saw. Did I definitely assess these? Um, because if I didn't, it'd be good to do. I'm coming. I did. I I figured. 
Shouldn't have second guessed myself. What are you gonna do? No need to panic. Back to good now. Alright. Keep those bum, gloves bum, up. Bum, 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 bum. Did you say coach? <laughs> I don't think I'm the coach. She's the one with all those lessons. I feel like this is gonna be a very hard place to find treasure. Probably just me. Oh, Materia. So glad I went this path. Poison, I'll take it. It's gotta be useful for something. High potions are nice. Need more of those, because I am broke. I'll bet I'm broke and I'm a mercenary. Or a merc, as they call him in this game. Alright, so I have to be down here. I know what I have to do. I have to hit the switch. I didn't want to do it yet, because I wanted to look for treasure. What did that do? Because I can't pass here. Do I have to like go on the other side or something? Or maybe I have to cross that thing that it was telling me? Like what did that open up for me? Oh, no, 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 not what I wanted. Papa. Oh, I see, I see. That's what they opened up. Makes sense. Do I only have two, um, three materia? Oh, wait, okay. I have four. Where's the purple one? I only see, like, three on my sword. Odd. Whatever, though. I love that they show the materia. That's, like, really nice attention to detail. It makes the weapon, like, look unique. Like, seeing your Buster Sword with, like, four purple ones is really cool. Really cool idea. I love it. Oh, new enemy. Alright. Assess you when I have enough. Alright, awesome. I don't care where you can do because you're gonna die. Die to Tifa. Also, I have to start on Star Shower. I should be almost proficient with it. Either way, I'll be using these weapons for a while. So, like, it doesn't really matter. I'll probably be using feathered gloves. Oh my god, the toad! This is the first time I got the toad status. Oh, you could actually stick out your tongue. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm actually playing as the toad. I was wondering when this would come. Alright, it's Clad. Also, the little Buster Sword is nice. I think they all have different designs. That's also really nice. That it? Does this get any better? This looks so iconic to the original. I love it. Like, little details. Like, how can you not tell this is Final Fantasy? This is Final Fantasy. Specifically, this is Final Fantasy VII. Like, I was a little worried this would change my view of the original. And change my view of the series in general, but... This just makes me like it even more. This makes me like Final Fantasy VII, especially like the actual game, even more. This increases my love for the game greatly. The original game, at least. Damn it. I can't stop thinking about what Corneo said. I know. Me too. It's got to be a trick. There's no way they'd go that far. But... But what if Corneo really was telling the truth? We have to get there in time to stop it. We have to. Right. <sighs> Aerith, what are you not telling me? Huh? Uh... Guys, come on. We gotta keep moving. Coming! 
I'll go first. Mm. Turn. On my way. Here we go. Almost there. me <laughs> least I could do hear that cloud <laughs> come on <laughs> they're just best friends they're not even like fighting over cloud yet I don't even know if there's gonna be any drama I'm actually really curious about that Because they seem really cool. They haven't once, like, fought over Cloud. And check here first. Alright, there's nothing. Now we can move on. Focus. Still thinking about the plate? Yeah. The future isn't set in stone. That's what I always tell myself. Yeah. I hope you're right. How about this then? Think of something fun. After saving Sector 7, you're gonna... I'm gonna... Go shopping. Topside. I'll buy stuff for the bar. Decorations. Coasters. Can I come? You'd better. Then it's a date. <laughs> <laughs> Cloud can carry all her stuff. He'll be our pack chocobo. <laughs> what was that about me? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Yo, I can't wait. I, I wish we actually see that. Come on, Tifa. But do one of those jumps again. Remember from the beginning of the game? Alright, not really what I wanted. But whatever. Sorry about that. No need to be. <sighs> Yo, can we actually see that shopping? Like at the end of the game, they all actually go shopping. Maybe Barrett and Marlene can come too. That'd be pretty cool. If we got that little insight on them actually doing that. I mean, I know how this game's gonna end, sort of, because they're gonna leave Midgar, but still, it'd be nice to include. If they had, like, a picture or something. <laughs> I'm coming, guys. Anything on sale here? Alright, nothing, I guess. I'm not even gonna bother wasting my money. This is just material. You don't even buy weapons. Thank God you don't buy weapons. You only have to worry about buying armor if needed. But honestly, I feel like armor is more like... Subjective. It's really your preference on what stats you want to raise, so... Just focusing on items and sometimes materia. Which you find most of your material, so I like that the game doesn't rely heavily on buying. Because you really don't get much money to buy stuff often. Wait, is that a chest? It's not. I thought I saw a chest on the other side of that. Either way, I wouldn't be able to get it. 